You know, I've been doing a lot of videos on SteelSeries Sonar. It's a new program that has come out that is free to use that you can use to tweak your microphone and control audio and do other things. It creates virtual devices that you can use in your live stream mix. It's a really nice little program. I've done an overview on it, and I've also just finished a video on how to tweak your microphone using the program. It's a really neat program, but one of the things that it does not do well is it does not tell you how to install it uh, because if you install it, you're going to find yourself looking for the actual Sonar app within the program unless you do one thing. So I'm gonna show you how to do that now, but before we do, let's talk about today's sponsor, Own.Pro. Today's video is sponsored by Own Pro, who has teamed up with Epidemic Sounds, give you access to their full library of music and sound effects. With your standard plus Epidemic Sound plan, you get access to over 10,000 songs, curated playlists, and over 25,000 different sound effects that you can use to customize your alerts. You can access the full library from your own pro dashboard, as well as customize your own playlist for your live streams. If you want to get access to the own pro epidemic sound subscription, click on my affiliate link down below and type in TFS at checkout for 50% off any subscription. Thank you own pro for sponsoring this video. Okay, so first thing you need to do is you'll need to go to the Steel Series website to get Steel Series GG. So I'll provide a link in the description below. Once you do that, get that in, get that up there. You'll click on the free download. You'll get that installed. Once you get that download, download, you'll click on the installer and run through the installer. Now it might take you a little bit. It took me quite a bit to get it uh, running and, and downloaded and all that stuff. But once you get it going, you'll run through the install process. It'll configure all of your files and try to figure out what all of your sound sources are. And then it'll run through this little wizard where you will then run through and answer all the questions here like a standard installer does. Uh, now, once this is completed, you'll go through and uh, it'll, it, again, this might take you a little bit to get through. Here I was installing and uninstalling an old, the old version. That's why it was taking longer for me here at this point. But once you get it all through, then you'll be able to run through this little configuration. Now, what you'll do here is you're going to go ahead and exit. All right. And you're going to bring the program up. You're going to need to have an account already. If you don't have an account, you can make one on the website. But go ahead and log into your account. Get the program up and running and you'll go into your general here and opt in for the beta this is important this is how you actually get access to the sonar app itself so you'll close that you'll go down to the lower right corner of windows close out the app completely by clicking the exit and then restart the program now i did the search here that's how i got access to it real quick but once you bring the program up then you should see sonar early access in the left little column there which is right there. Now, once you click on the Sonar Early Access, it's going to do a configuration wizard to get all your devices set up. And this might take a little bit of time also, but you'll go through and you'll choose each of your devices for your game, your chat, and your microphone, which is the three main functions of Sonar. Once you get that set up, then it's going to run through, like I said, trying to get this device set up and once you get that done though, you'll be ready to go where you can go and you can tweak your game audio, your chat audio and your microphone. So it's that easy. It's not hard at all to do. And what, like I said, once it's set up and ready to go, you're rolling and it's a nice little program that's quite stable and works quite well. All right, everybody, I hope this video helped you out. If you got any questions about Sonar, I'll provide links in the description below again for the overview video and the mic tuning video that I just released a couple of days ago. But again, Comment below if you got any questions, and I will try my best to answer. Again, thank you, Own.Pro, for sponsoring this video. Have a great rest of your week, and we'll see you later.